afternoon everybody and welcome back as you just saw uh, the Hulk went from there over there and that's to make it a bit easier to get it home so get in the, there we go get out of the light so today come out to specifically move the tractor before it rains so I can get it back into town um, gonna keep greater blading and have a look it's a bit it's a bit dry today feel like I should have watered but they're saying rain from midnight so I'm gonna resist and be strong uh, and in other breaking news I just lost the key to the tractor so it's in there with all the snakes so thankfully it's just a piece of fencing wire bent in the shape of a fish hook but frustration it's real so we'll go get the battery we'll go and do some gratering uh, my trees didn't arrive today i made another 200 cuttings at home so it's been a busy day but once again though uh awful awful weather all right shocking but they reckon two inches of rain tonight so we'll see anyway back soon one thing we've noticed in the recent weeks is the apostle birds are getting very friendly great bird very very noisy and the white moths are coming back so you can just see them flying through they're smashing my cauliflowers and my broccolis but they're um part of nature so uh today's job is to take this tractor and this greater blade and continue to flatten all the grass and find all the obstacles uh one thing i have to do is straighten it uh, not straighten it pull it back from this end slide it back across as i've been driving along dragging it it's slowly walking its way out so i've got to fix that but what it's proving quite useful for is pulling out all the big rocks and the stumps so that's a greater blade exposure and now there's a stump or two over here just to show you so it just pulls the rocks and the stumps out and while i've then got to come through and pick all them up it's better than finding them with the slasher at speed um, these handful of trees that are still here that killed the Massey last week I'm going to jump on the Massey and push them over and stick them out in this bush over here to continue to rot quietly but that's the mission uh, I was going to try and get this slash before it rained I don't like my chances because I've got to do this whole top piece here all around here and I've still got a little bit to do at the bottom so doesn't matter, I'll put some uh, fuel in the tractor and some water in a radiator because it seems to be using a little bit, um, which I think is more related to radiator cap than radiator. And then we'll hook in. So, stuck in.
violence and swearing will be required. Righto, greater blades done, uh, lots of swearing, lots of big hammers and uh, I need to fix that problem. Uh, Herbie's got a fresh tank of juice, Trevor's going to get a run up if we get enough time, so let's go grade some stuff. So I still have to just finish this little section here off and this little section here. So I'll hook in, I'll get it done and then uh, hopefully we can run the slash up. But what it does, and I'm going to have to walk through and do most of this by hand, is it pulls all this out. So it pulls that tree stump out, pulls this rock out and they're all slasher killers. So. It's worth the time, it might not be pretty, but it does the job. So, haven't finished the job, sun's gone, haven't done any slashing, haven't used the loader, but did break something, so today's not a total loss. So, there's four bolts, one, two, three, and this is where number four goes, that holds this blade in place. At some point I've hit a stump and broken the bolt, so that's supposed to go in there with another end of it under there. So I've got a couple of new bolts, that's no biggie. And ultimately it's designed to break and if it's not designed to break, well, well done whoever made it, because it broke. The other bolt that I lost or broke was the bolt that holds this in place. So that's why we stopped. I do have another one of those. I just haven't bought it from the shop yet. So. I'll keep this as a memento and do something with it. But I'll show you what we did and then we'll sign off and go and do some other jobs. It's never a there's always a job, always a job. So I got most of the what I wanted to do done and it's working really well. It's uh, pulling the stumps up, 
it's pulling the rocks up and it's making everything a little bit easier to see. Uh, it's things like this. This rock will kill my slasher, but I'll drive through here with a loader bucket and pick it all up. It's, uh, it's things like popping these bits of wood up. Again, I'll run through here with a loader tomorrow and pick them up. Here, here's another one. Not a big rock. So that's what it's about. These trees could almost push that over, but I'll use the loader. A couple that survived. Um, there's another another rock in there. There's a big stump here. It's now over there. Um, I don't know why I went around this one. I don't know. Um, but over here, I'll show you where I broke the bolt. So this stump here, oh, here's the washer that goes with the bolt. There you go. So this stump here, this came from a tree that's now scattered all over the place. It's what broke the bolt. Um, I haven't found the other end of the bolt yet. Kind of handy if I did, because I could recycle the nuts off it. But it could be anywhere. Uh, it let go at speed with a big ping. So it quite seriously could have gone for miles. Um, I'll probably find it with the slasher when it goes ping and shoots off into the sky or into the back of the tractor or... Anyway, that's a different day. So, um, I don't know how well you can see it, but I flattened all the grass up to just up the top here. Uh, I'll get the rest of the stumps and the trees tomorrow. We flattened all the way down to the, not this waterway, the next waterway. And then the end of my clearing for the year is just up there. So, I'm close. Uh, probably another session on the grader tomorrow. If it's not raining, we'll get the top bit done here and the far bit done down there. And then I can just start driving the loader up and down. And uh, then it's slasher time because this is how good it looks when it's all cleaned up. Uh, so it will be nice, but I've just got to get rid of all the schmutz through here. Um, again, I don't know why people cut the stumps off at that height. Either cut them off at the ground or let them grow. I'd rather knock them down when they're dead. So... Um, just to put some perspective, the far end of the blocks down there, that's where we've planted. Silver dollar gums are over here. And the other end of my block is right down in line with those trees. So we're slowly getting there. Anyway, um, sun's gone, it's getting cold. It's supposed to rain tonight. As you can see, it's really, really not cloudy. Um, so I'll sign off and see you next time. Probably tomorrow. Um, if it is raining, I don't know. don't know what I'll do, whether I'll loader or slash or stay home on the couch and watch YouTube. Have a great night. See you tomorrow. Hey, fellas. How you doing? Rain's coming. Get ready for it. So pretty. You guys have a good night. I'll see you tomorrow.